Roll tape. What is Victoria's Secret in three, two, one, go. Off and running. Rock and roll. It's empowering, strong, fierce, sexy, iconic. The wings. Successful, confident women. Really powerful young women. Tyra Banks, Heidi Klum, Giselle Bunchen, Adriana, Helena Christensen, Alessandra, and all those girls who are all strong women who have something to say. I want to be like that. Here she comes, here she comes, here she comes. It's Monday, so it is the start of the Victoria's Secret challenge diet workout thing that I'm doing for a week. I was looking at which workout I kind of wanted to do, and today I'm going to try and follow what Bella Hadid does. Bella Hadid spends a lot of time working out. She does a mixture of cardio, boxing, and weights. When I work out, I love to work out. Like I train and I work out hard for two okay. hours. I don't like to do the whole yoga thing. I, I, I think yoga is calming, it's amazing. But if I'm gonna go for it, I'm gonna go hard. I literally think I would die if I did two to three hours worth of exercise. But I did do a 20 minute straight run, one hour worth of weights, and the workout her trainer told Women's Health in an interview. left my green juice in the boot. I did the 20 minute run and it was all right actually. Found it quite easy. I don't know whether I should have run a bit faster. <laughs> I did all that, where's my seatbelt? Without having any breakfast because a lot of them do a fasted workout. I was starving, but I just quickly went into Tesco to get a few bits and bobs and they have a whole sushi counter. And I know they all have sushi because I watched their YouTube videos and even in the researches that I've done, research, I have found that they eat sushi. So I got some sushi for my lunch, but for my breakfast, I got myself a green juice. And also I've almost drank a liter, 1.5 liters of water. Cause on this bloody website that I was looking at, they, it says they have two to four liters of water a day. I struggle to have one. So this is gonna be a real test. Now let's try this. Mmm, it's really nice actually. Maybe don't smell it first though, because it doesn't smell as nice as it tastes. Because she works out so much, Bella does have quite a flexible diet. She, like loads of other Victoria's Secret models, loves to eat sushi. I saw somewhere, and now I literally cannot find where I saw it, that they like to eat seaweed. So I'm gonna have this as a snack. It's all right. ASMR though. As I didn't quite do two hours worth of exercise, I went on a really long walk with my mum and my dog. Those are the swans. Yeah, you are, mum. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it's clear Bella Hadid loves Mexican food, so I decided to make a Mexican salad bowl so I could keep the carbs down. I did, though, make some gluten-free nachos, and they were a 10 out of 10. Look how big that is. That is literally like the size of my head and my head is big. Hey, it's Gigi Hadid. We're here at Gotham Gym and I'm about to work out with my trainer Rob Piella here in New York. Let's go to the ring and get started. Just like her sister, Gigi Hadid also goes hard in the gym. In an interview with Vogue, she shares her workout routine, so I copied that. Your left hand at them. It's called a jab. After doing so much research into what Victoria's Secret models eat, I found they all love to eat oats for breakfast and they add loads of fancy toppings, but I kind of just had the standard stuff. And then I had a chicken salad, I had chicken, avocado, lettuce, tomato, cucumber, spring onion. But yeah, all of them have chicken salad. I think I've heard Kendall have it, Gigi, Bella, Candice, Romy, all of them, literally. I researched and I swear chicken salad is the main thing those girls eat. Tonight I'm having a burger because Gigi Hadid promotes her love for burgers and you know what? I love her for it. I don't love her but <laughs> I mean I respect her for it. I don't actually have meat burgers in 
but I do have the Linda McCartney veggie mozzarella burgers and they are a winner. My yoga mat matches my outfit. <laughs> I think Candice Swanepoel is one of the first girls I followed that was a Victoria's Secret model and kind of introduced me to that world. She's literally stunning and she starts her day off with yoga because it helps both your mental and physical well-being. My yoga partner was not keeping up, snoring throughout the session. Candice has said before she thinks breakfast is the most important meal of the day but what she eats depends on the day. Sometimes it's a smoothie, sometimes it's eggs, sometimes it's even grilled cheese. I went for poached eggs and a smoothie this morning because that's just what I fancied. And then for my lunch I was a little rushed because I had to go into work and Candice says like literally all the other angels she has a chicken salad and yeah. I'm sensing a trend here. After work, my mom had made dinner and it was pasta. A lot of Victoria's Secret models love Italian food. Bella Hadid has actually even said if she could eat one food for the rest of her life, it would be pasta. Candice likes to work out a lot. I'd already done the yoga in the morning, but she tends to do Pilates in the evening. Oh, I'd look cool doing this, I just look ridiculous. <laughs> <laughs> and it was so much harder than I imagined like I did burpees and everything but yeah it was actually really really good and yeah I'd have nothing else to say <laughs> hello Romy is a YouTuber I have actually followed for so long now, so I kind of know her day-to-day -day eating and exercising habits. She actually has so many videos on exercise and like what she eats in a day and just general Victoria's Secret videos. So if you want to see them, I'd suggest checking out her channel. I've woke up and I've made overnight oats. I've watched so many of her Why in a days and she always makes overnight oats or like chia pudding. So I make overnight oats and put chia seeds in them as well. I've seen her use goji berries before, so I use goji berries. She usually uses blueberries, but I didn't have any, so I've used strawberries and she puts like peanut butter or almond butter on it. So this is very similar to what she has. Then I'm also like actually watching one of her videos right now. Like this was posted 10 hours ago and she's showing what she eats. And it is a tuna, brown rice, peas. She said she'd usually put avocado in. So that's what I'm gonna make for my lunch. Also, it's Monday in the video. She posted this 10 hours ago and she says on Monday she's eating sushi. And on Monday, I ate sushi. So am I Romy? I really am. I really am a Victoria's Secret model. So I've got home from work. I've got my little PT in the background watching over me because she does no work. She just sits there and watches. So kind of slacking. Um, but yeah, I had that tuna, rice, peas, and um, what else was in it? Avocado, and it was low key. The driest meal I've ever had so that was fun I will not be having that again probably <laughs> but it did the job it was it was all right so now I am gonna do a workout and I think she has some of her own workouts on YouTube so I'm gonna look at that and then do that of course people like Romy and probably literally all the other Victoria's Secret angels have personal trainers and it's good she posts all her videos on YouTube but it's just a shame I don't have the same facilities and god I wish I had a personal trainer as well um, but yeah her videos are really really good I did the legs and the abs one. So I need to drink all of this and then I'll hit my three litre target. Shall I try and down some? Way more than that. For dinner, Romy uses HelloFresh a lot, I've seen on her YouTube, and they do loads of veggie curries on there. So I decided to make this paneer curry with brown rice, and oh my god, it's really, really good. You need to try it.
She wakes up at 5.30 a.m. every day, which was extremely hard for me, and she starts the day with a hot lemon water, which I thought was gross, and a smoothie, which again, wasn't my favorite. She then does some meditation and yoga, which is very typical LA and Victoria's Secret model kind of stuff. Just finished yoga. Molly was with me again. She loves a bit of yoga. Um, I've got to admit, I don't think I'm a very zen person. <laughs> I just, I don't know if I just can't take myself seriously. Um, and I'm more of a drink a coffee, get buzzed, do a workout kind of girl. But it was quite nice though, and I felt very relaxed, so it was okay. Um, but yeah, I don't know why I had to wake up at half five to do that, but I did. And now I have the rest of the day, I suppose. First, I'm gonna go make some pancakes. This smoothie is not the best, but... I drink it anyway and make some pancakes. She makes the tiniest pancakes. It was truly a task keeping them this small. My pancakes are low-key a little bit yellow because I used turmeric last night and I think it stained the pan <laughs> and now my pancakes are yellow. Um, so that's not ideal, but turmeric is one of those, that spices that people have like turmeric shots and stuff. So I'm just being healthy. This is just a new health trend to have turmeric pancakes, so. Also, the mini shape just isn't for me. For my lunch, um, Miranda Kerr says she has like chicken and stuff, so I think I'm gonna have some chicken sausages just for like some protein. And then I was just searching like a what I eat in a day because I didn't really wanna just eat chicken sausages on their own. So I've decided to make one slice of toast with avocado on and a fried egg because if you search Romy Strid, I know I always go on about her, but she's got the most on YouTube. One of her what I eat in a day, just the photo on it, even that is just avocado, fried egg, toast, and then with some chicken sausages. So I'm like having a mixture. I mean, they all probably eat that anyway, so that's what I'm gonna have. And then look at this, what I got at the shop. Look how bloody healthy that looks. It's a super seeded boule. She's very healthy. She's one of the healthiest in this video, I think. I copied one of her go-to dinners and it was actually really, really good. I also felt so, so full. Elsa Hosk, I think that's how you say her name. I actually have no idea, but anyway, she is literally gold. Her day-to-day -day diet includes things like oats, a lot of green vegetables, green juices, potato salads, eggs and yogurts. She's not really a snacker, which is a bit of a nightmare because I am such a snacker and she tends to eat mostly main meals. So for breakfast, I had oats again and then I went to the gym where her go-to exercises include running and then she likes to kind of switch it up. So I did some circuits with my sister as well. When I got home, I attempted a green juice, but it turned out more brown than green. And I had a leftover salad from the day before. So I had that for my lunch. And then for dinner, I had jacket potato and salad, which by this point I was getting literally so tired of eating so much salad, as you can probably tell by my face. <laughs> It is day seven, the last day. I've done a full week almost, just need to do today. And today I'm doing Adriana Lima. count to the BS in two, one. About 20 seconds to Adriana. Adriana is known for her extreme workout and diet plans. Apparently before the show, she only consumes liquids for a week, which we shall not be doing, lol. <laughs> she is said to train like a professional boxer getting ready for a fight and her workouts consist of mainly HIIT and cardio. Ooh, that was really hard. 
but I did 500 calories, so <sighs> that was really hard. She eats six small meals a day and is scarily healthy, and like all the others, drinks loads of water. I had oats and a protein shake, chickpeas, rice, and edamame beans. I put a bit of paprika on my chickpeas as well because I like them like that spinach tomatoes and a source of protein and then a drum roll another goddamn chicken salad this was actually only five meals i kind of failed at this one but it was hard i've just got back from work and my sister and her boyfriend are going to the gym and they've asked if i want to go and so i'm gonna go because i feel like adriana lima would say yes and if she trains like an athlete I'm gonna train like an athlete, even though I've already done an hour worth of hit this morning. I'm a warrior. Warrior. <laughs> I also, like I said, went and did another workout. I did the 12, 3, 30 workout, which I know is very popular among celebs. Kylie Jenner actually posted it on her story the other day, and her sister Kendall is a Victoria's Secret model. So therefore, I decided it was a suitable exercise. <laughs> I also use this thing for abs because I watched a video of Romy using it and it was extremely hard. Okay, so that is the end of the week and the end of this video. I actually enjoyed trying out their workouts so much. I'll put a quick before and after of me, but I personally don't think I've actually changed that much. Just wanted to quickly say also that in my before and after, my after, I have got a fresh layer of tan on and when you have tan on I swear you always look more defined and a bit slimmer so take that into consideration and also all the girls in the video have admitted that they are very genetically slim, they have a high metabolism, so as much as I'd love to look like all of them and like work out like them, we are all different and just because we do the same things as them doesn't mean we'd end up the same as them, so I just want to keep that in mind for, for me and also for like you watching, but yeah. You look beautiful. I have weighed myself and I have actually lost two pounds, but I don't know whether that's to do with like how much I've exercised. I don't know. It is good I've lost two pounds, but at the same time, sometimes I kind of was feeling hungry and stuff, so I don't think it's very, what's the word? I don't think you can do this forever. And I think you should always listen to your body and what your body wants and what you think you need. I don't know, but it's good to stay healthy and try new things. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video and I don't know what else to say. Um, <laughs> if you wanna see me try any other diets or anything like that, just let me know in the comments or any new exercise apps. I'm always up for trying something new. But yeah, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next week.